Reggie, you, you want to give a quick tour of the yard? Let's go outside and give a quick tour. Where are we at now? We're in the casita. Want to go outside? Let's go look outside. Come on. Let's give Allison a... Come on. Let's give Allison a quick tour of the yard. All right. That's our uh, Kamado pot I bought. And that's Grandpa's work area. And... This is, uh, of course, where everybody comes out here and sits and dies a heat stroke. We got our um, hummingbird feeders, the kayak, work in progress. Actually, there's not much left on it to do. My leg gets a little bit better. I'm going to be back out here and finish it real quick. So, hopefully I'll have that in the water. Over here is my newest acquisition is my uh little um cactus and uh over here are my california poppies and i planted some more a grapefruit tree some kind of plant that grandma has our swiss chard this is right here we were getting eaten up um by insects um apparently it might have been ants i put out ant killer yesterday and there are no ants in the yard at all around the house or otherwise these are the tomatoes they're growing a little bit of time i got one the other day this is the boat another work in progress we still have some stuff to mount on it Grapevines, four of them. Uh, Thompson Seedless here. This is uh, going on second year. First year, first year. And my favorite is my Concord, which we got. And it took off and almost died. We got our money back from Amazon on it. And it also has the biggest grapes on it. Unbelievable. The plant over here that's spreading, going that direction, are, is a watermelon plant. Over here, we have a squash plant. And I don't know if you can see, but there's all kinds of squash in there. Some kind of fruit tree that I'd asked for that Grandpa put in. I'm not sure what it they took all the labels off of it her uh, palm tree that never grew another fruit tree i asked for it they didn't leave a label on i don't know what it is this is my bay leaf tree for cooking it'll grow this is the apricots and they're growing we're fighting birds that's what these um aluminum tape um, things are they keep they reflect keep the birds off of it as much as possible and uh, actually they're pretty good they're getting ripe pretty quick uh, that one right there is ready and you can see this one it's overripe probably no good it's got bug eating on it and uh, since I put ant killer out on it they ooh, there's another one uh ant killer on it because the ants seem to like eating them there's one there that got eaten by a bird and but anyway it does a good job of keeping them off i should get out here and can some of these I can see I'm going to be the only one in the family to do this shit, but nonetheless, um, I'll, uh, I'll have to do it. And this is our plum tree. Plums are mostly on the top. There's a little plum right there, and we'll see what happens. This is our 
Um, let's see, that is the persimmon tree we just put in. And nothing seems to be bothering those. This is our fig tree. It started out about that high last year and it has taken off. We, of course, we don't have any figs. This is your pomegranate. They won't start blooming until later. Lemon trees and uh, lemons. And you see those black spots or a blight, and which is a fungus. And then I've got to figure out how to get rid of it. Orange tree. You can see little oranges. I don't know, it's kind of bright right now. The little oranges right there. Here's some right here. Little oranges that are, they won't come out until the fall. Rhubarb getting eaten by bugs. I put stuff in there and hopefully that stops. This stuff here, all spices, sage, so on and so forth, all the way up to a rosemary. And our cherry tree did have cherries this year. Birds ate them all. So anyway, that goes with that. And what else can I show you? Um, interesting. Um, looks like we got a gopher there. I got to show that to Grandpa. Um, anyhow, um, it's getting awful hot. Let's we'll see how long this gopro last probably not long stay out of the sun take you around here here's our stolen rock collection of course now she's having a heyday watch out rich you stay here a heyday um flying those over the yard when she found out how much it cost this is our uh, our cactus farm that they got going on. Of course, uh, they're a little Toyota with expired plates. Let's see how long that goes. Garbage can, my gray Toyota over there that I drive. Came back from the shop, air conditioning's fixed. And we'll check out the front of the house before this thing overheats see the yard I love this tree here and uh, these are ornamental flowers of whatever type I have no idea and of course the neighbors next door and uh, uh, Carol across the street there and that's about it anyway I'm on the way back in and we'll see if we can get this downloaded to you and uh, get it sent. Anyway, I love you, hon. And uh, you take care. Reggie and I will be here waiting on you. All right. Love you. Bye.